Hello everyone, it's Yvonne here from the Aussie Goddess to do the very last reading for the week and it's for the sign of Gemini. Gemini, I do want to say thank you for supporting me on the channel. Please make sure if the reading resonates that you give it a thumbs up. Um, I also want to say if you're interested in joining me for classes, um, the classes are now up for July. I will be doing them by Zoom, so you can do them no matter where you are in the world, as long as the timing is right, of course. Um, if you would like a personal reading, all the details are below. And if you'd like to donate to the channel to help us grow, then you can do that via the Aussie Goddess page. There is a donate button now on the head page. Please remember here, <laughs> wishes do come true. Okay, whatever you're wishing for. Um, do remember that the readings are only general though. Uh, if it's not your story, don't try to make it fit. Okay. Well, very nice. So we have the High Priestess coming out. Now, sometimes the High Priestess talks about learning to use our intuition. You know, have it be more insightful, um, trying to look deep, more deeply at things. But sometimes she can talk about things that are hidden from view. So there appears to be something hidden from you here that you are not quite aware of. And I know that because of the moon sign sig signals here. So it's like you only have a little bit of information here and it's you can't make a decision based in this small amount of information. It's got something to do with your family or something to do with your long-term security or stability here. Okay, so for some of you here, this could be about um, having a situation where possibly something has come between you and your partner that's interrupting your family or your family situation. Yeah, you're moving away from something. I feel like something has, something has stalled your happiness here. Um, it could be a, a, a something that's come between you and a family member. But I feel that you're moving away from this and rebuilding. You don't have the full story yet. So perhaps you're trying to make a decision based in what you know, but you need to know more before you can really decide. For some of you, this looks like you may have um, a situation in your relationship that has just come to hand. You could have found something out. You could have um, discovered something and now you need to make a decision. But it is changing your family unit, which gives rise to the fact you may be leaving somebody. Somebody may be leaving you or you could have had some sort of uncomfortable situation with a family member and it may be resulting in walking away from someone. Okay, so you could have got some sort of message here with the Page of Wands. Um, the Page of Wands is a messenger. He does bring in news. Um, now, very often the wand is, is a, a, a symbol of um, passion and love. You may have discovered something here. Let's keep going. Something's got you really wound up with this Eight of Swords, though. Okay, we do have the Magician here. Okay, and we have the Two of Swords. You're making a decision here. Now, it could be you that's making a decision between your partner and someone else. Um, but what I get a feeling of here is that you've discovered something about your partner um, or a family member that you don't have all the information about at the moment, but you have some information on that's put you in a bit of a, a sort of in your head a little bit about how to manage this. Um, I feel that you could be dealing with someone who's quite manipulative here, um, someone who's quite controlling. So it could be a partner. But I feel like something's happening here that's pushing you to make a decision on whether you go any further with this or whether you stick it out. Um, but I actually think that you're, you're ready to cut something out here. Let's keep going. All right, it's definitely got something to do with marriage. I wasn't sure to start off with, but it does look like that. You're feeling left out in the cold here. Now, again, remember these readings flip-flop. This could be the person you're dealing with. Some sort of truth is coming to hand, though. 
Somebody is going to tell you the truth about something. You may have found, you may have discovered um, communications. You may have um, somebody else may have told you something's happened too. I don't feel that the person who is responsible here has spoken up yet, but they are going to going forward. Um, I feel like you've caught someone out at something. Okay, so we have the Ace of Pentacles here, followed by the World card. There's definitely a closing. And we do have the Sun. Maybe there's some of you are happy to just split resources here and go on your own way and close something out. Something here has come to light. Something here has come to your awareness and you are moving away from it now. Now, for some of you, this may be about divorce or separation because I do have a lot of cards here that show that whatever this information is, it cannot repair what you've gone through. Um, and I feel like you're moving away from a situation here. There is sort of a good outcome. So for whoever this is for, it's sort of like maybe this has been playing on their mind for a long while. Um, something's been discovered here. Something that was hidden has been discovered. And it's got something to do with the family unit. There seems to be some pain or heartbreak. But when the threes come through like this, I can't help thinking something's interfered with a third party. Uh, a, a third situation here. Um, sometimes this can be, you know... Uh, another, another situation, I've got all sorts of things going through my head at the moment, um, but it could be a situation here that's pulled two people apart because I see someone moving away from something here. I feel that someone is um, has been either given some information or received some information that's maybe allowed them to see more deeply into something. Um it could be something to do with a divorce situation. You could have found out somebody wasn't being true to you. Somebody could have found out you weren't doing the right thing. So if you're not doing the right thing, it's possible somebody could already know here. Um, somebody's discovered something, but they just don't have all the information at the moment. They are looking for it with this magician. So somebody is trying to work out what's going on here. Um, you could have been in a situation with someone who was very controlling um, and very uh, manipulative and it may be good to find something on them to move away because I do see sort of like this closing down, this money settlement, new start and the sun here. So I feel like in the long run, somebody here is getting away from something which is going to result in a good, happy ending. But at the moment, there's a lot of... Um, energy around frustration worry and sadness but i feel at the end of the day it's going to have a good result um, huge decision to be made on which direction to go in and somebody's having to do that but seeing the sun at the end here makes me think that at the end everything will turn out the way it needs to go now if this is someone you're dealing with gemini it's possible that they are leaving someone for you if this is you doing this, it's possible you have found out something about somebody else that will give you an opportunity to move forward. We do have the card of the hunter coming out here. It says here, rely on your own skills to traverse the thick forest you are in to reach your destination. You need to follow the tracks left by spirit to claim your bounty, which is already prepared and being offered to you. Do not follow the maps drawn by others as they will not lead you true. Instead, become the map maker, find your internal compass and use all of your senses, including your common sense. Um, so I think what they're saying here is you need to make sure you've got all of the information before you move forward. Don't rely on what other people are telling you. Make sure you're fully resourced before you make a decision. I do think you've got some sort of good outcome here. Um, but whatever this is, if it's a family situation, if it's a relationship situation, all ends well. But at the moment, it's like you're trying to act on only half the information. So you need to make sure that you have what you need before you move away to have this sort of good outcome. Thanks, Gemini.